Hey everybody, welcome back to Mission Troll for a feature focus video. In this video, we're going to talk about Record Mode Quick Build. When recording or building a chase or cue list, you can use Record Mode Quick Build to quickly record from existing palettes or playbacks. When using playbacks to quick build, you do not have to keep the original playbacks. You can delete and or move them, and it will not affect your cue list or chase. If you edit the original playbacks, it will not edit your cue list or chase. See our videos on autoload for placing playbacks in a cue list that link to the original playback where editing the playback will also update the cue list. See the link in the description. You can also filter the playback or palette being used by selecting only the fixtures you want to be quickly built. When using Quick Build, it will not record anything you have in the programmer, only what is in the palette and or playback being used. To do a Quick Build record, for a chase, press record, then select Create Chase on the soft keys or just press record twice. For a cue list, press record and then select cue list on the soft keys or press record three times. Select the playback to record the blue or top key on a fader or the executor slash playbacks window handle button. On soft key A, change record mode to quick build. Then click the blue or top key on a fader or the palette you want to quick build into the cue list or chase. If you want to filter in only some fixtures, select them individually or by group before doing this. Press clear and then exit and test your playback. So let's have a look at that. Here I am on version 16 on the Titan Go virtual interface. And we see here I've just got some playbacks. So if I wanted to quick build a chase, I could hit record twice and see that I have a create chase selected here. And I'll go ahead and select an empty fader. And then I'll change my record mode to quick build. And now I can just tap the blue key of each of my existing cues here, and we see each time I clicked it, it added it to a step. So I can go ahead and hit exit, and now if we bring up my chase, I can see my fixtures chasing that I had recorded, including the shapes. If I wanted to only have, say, just my BMFLs from each of these playbacks recorded into a chase, I can go ahead and hit record twice again, and we'll select this fader. And we'll set a record mode back to quick build again. And then we'll go ahead and select just our BMFLs. And now if we tap the blue swap button on each of these playbacks. And then exit and clear. And bring up our chase now. We see it only used the BMFLs from each of those playbacks. Of course, we can do the exact same thing with the keyless. So we can hit record three times. And see it's selected create keyless for us. And we'll select an empty fader here. And we'll change our record mode to quick build. And we'll tap our blue key on each one. And then exit and clear. And we'll bring our key list up and we'll hit go. And we'll see our first queue, our second queue, our third, our fourth, our fifth, and lastly our sixth one. And we'll just release that one. Again, I can filter it out to say uh, just my Beam 150s. So we'll go ahead and do record three times again. See, it says create queue list. And we'll select our last fader here. And I'll change it to quick build. And we'll select just our Beam 150s. And we'll do the same thing with their blue key of each of our queues. And then exit and clear. And we'll bring up our queue list and hit go and see it has just our B150s from each of those queues. It can also be done with palettes. So we'll change pages here, have some blank faders, and we'll hit record twice and choose create chase and we'll select here. And then we'll go ahead and I'll change the record mode to quick build and we'll just tap our palettes here, and then we'll exit it out, and we'll select our fixtures, and give them some intensity, and now we'll fire our chase, and we can see that it pulled the palette information from each one, and we'll go ahead and hit clear, and turn this off, and again, we can do the same thing with a key list, we can hit record three times, select an empty fader, Change our record mode to quick build. And we'll do it with just our O or DL7s for this one. And we'll tap each one. 
and then we'll hit exit and clear and we'll give these some intensity we'll bring our cue to this double hit go in our first position our second position and our third position and lastly our fourth one we can of course also do a combination of palettes and playbacks so we hit record three times and we'll select an empty fader here and we'll go ahead and change our record mode to quick build and we'll see if we'll go ahead and we'll tap uh, this playback and then we'll select these fixtures and we'll do uh, this one this palette this palette this palette and this palette and see it step through it each time so we're going to hit exit and clear and now we'll bring our cue list up and we'll hit go and we'll see our first cue and then our second palette our third palette our th or excuse me our third and then our fourth so that has been using Record Mode Quick Build in version 16 of Titan. I hope you learned something. Join us on Facebook at Ableites US. Join us here next time. Please subscribe. Thanks. Bye. Wheel stop. Roger. Wheel stop, Discovery. Welcome back. A great ending to the new beginning.